Hello, Dominic from BMT, the website for beginners to advanced players. And the title was Play the line of the ball. Now, this is a tip for beginners and intermediate players to have better contact with the ball, more control, and for that, being able to play longer rallies and having more fun in playing tennis. Now, what is the line of the ball? Check out this video. Now, here we have the bounce of the ball and at one point the ball will start to come down in the second curve of the ball which is now and this is the line that you want to go up so if you go up in the same line that the ball comes down you will always have a good contact with the ball at bmt we talk a lot about the bounce and the turn so we have to turn the racket in the line of which the ball will come down and from there we will go up towards contact so if the line and the ball uh, the line of the ball and the racket are on the same line the same path it will be much easier to have a good contact so how do we turn the racket in that line and where do we turn it in the line check out this video so here we see the ball coming down the bounce and you see the racket starts to go so we have here the bounce and the turn and uh, here the forward movement starts and if we draw a line you will see that the line is very close to where the ball is and she goes up in that line and she makes a very nice contact with the ball and we have the same in the back end so also here we will turn the racket in the line of the ball like this and if we draw a line again you will see it will be very close to where the ball is and from there we go up towards contact and you can see here we have a very clean contact in the middle of the racket and what's the forehand from a other angle and again here the bouncer turn the racket in the line so here it's in the line now let's check out the line and you can see it's very close to where the ball is and from there on you go to contact and as you can see again a very good contact and you touch and you finish from there now you don't only have the advantage of making a good contact the second advantage is that you also have a longer contact zone if you go up in that line you can touch the ball here or here or here or there and still make a great contact and for that i recommend to beginners and children to start higher balls if the ball comes higher it will be slower it will give you more time to take a better position more time to learn to watch the ball more time to turn the racket in the right angle and more time to go to your contact so for that let's check out this stroke so higher balls have higher bounces so watch how high the ball goes up which is slower and gives her more time to turn a racket in this angle so let's draw the line and you can see it's very close to that ball and now he has plenty of time to go towards that contact so we have seen that the ball comes from much higher and it will also return much higher which is normal if you play that line but once the level is going up you can start to bring the ball down and you will see that the racket will not be like this but the racket will be more like that and for that going more in that line playing a lower ball but still having a great contact and a long contact zone so these were the tips for today thank you for watching see you in the next video